third of the Philadelphia chromosome, then you're already close to understanding the BCRABL test. The BCRABL test detects a specific genetic mutation caused by a translocation between chromosomes 9 and 22. This mutation creates the BCRABL fusion gene, which produces an abnormal protein that drives uncontrolled white blood cell growth. It's found in nearly all cases of chronic myeloid leukemia and in some patients with acute lymphoblastic leukemia. This test plays three vital roles. First, it helps confirm a diagnosis of CML or pH positive ALL. Second, it's used to monitor how well treatment is working, especially with targeted drugs called tyrosine kinase inhibitors. And third, it helps detect relapse or resistance even before symptoms return. The test is usually done on blood or bone marrow, and it's performed repeatedly over time to track disease activity. If BCRABL levels drop or become undetectable, that's a sign treatment is working. If levels rise, it may signal relapse or that the treatment needs to be adjusted. It's also possible to test for mutations in the BCRABL gene itself, which can guide the next step in treatment if resistance develops. It's not just a diagnostic tool, but it's a roadmap that helps doctors personalize care.